count if not blank. This is what we are going to look at in that example. So here we have a table and as you can see in this table there is an empty row and now we basically want to count the rows which are not empty. And for that there actually exists a function which is called count a. As you can see it counts the number of cells in a range that are not empty. Now when we type in the opening bracket we simply select the range in which we want to count the items which are not empty. So as you can see here um, we have one cell which is empty. Now when we type the closing bracket and hit the enter key you can see that we have 16 counted cells. Now when we select this range in the bottom right corner you can see that this range actually contains 16 cells. So why is there no difference? The reason for that is simple. The empty looking cell actually contains a space. So when we highlight the content in the formula bar you can see that there is a space. And this is what I wanted to show you in this example. We have to remove the space so always make sure that the cell is really empty then hit the enter key and now you can see that we have 15 cells so one less and that is correct since this one here is empty and by the way if you want to know how to count cells based on a specific condition or how to count cells based on multiple conditions then simply go into the video description there you have the link to the video for these examples and that's it for now if you like the video please don't forget to subscribe and to hit the like button